Hey guys, today I'm gonna to talk about my six favorite dress shoes. Hey guys, welcome back to Jen's Lounge. If you haven't hit that subscribe button yet, hit that button right now. If you haven't hit that little bell icon, I don't even know where it is, but hit that thing. I guess it's very important so you get notifications every time we release an awesome video. All right guys, so now on to my six favorite dress shoes. I'm going to preface before I show you any of them that these are not the most versatile shoes in my closet. These are just my favorites and the ones that I seem to be wearing more often than not. I do have, you know, regular black Oxfords and some wingtips and stuff like that, but these are kind of my more fun favorite dress shoes. So up first, got this tassel loafer from Crosby Square. These babies are awesome. I wear them with denim, I wear them with suits, I wear them probably more often than I should because it's winter right now and I wear them without socks, but it is in Southern California, so it's not that cold, but these babies are super versatile, blue suede, tassel loafer, um, super comfy, got a little, you know, a little Italian flair to them. So these are number one on the favorite shoe list. I guess I should say these are in no particular order. All right, and up next, let's go with uh, these hole cuts from Two Boot New York, a little broguing on the toe. Nice patina going on there. Um, all one piece of leather, which is what makes them a whole cut. But anytime you bust these shoes out, people are gonna say something. They're just a beautiful looking shoe. Um, these go great with suits. I don't wear them with jeans too much because they're kind of a very fancy shoe. But um, you know, I think I have a picture of a, me in a pinstripe suit with these guys on. So I'll see if I can find that and put that up right here for y'all. All righty. Um, up next, probably the most versatile shoe in the list, and I picked this solely based on comfort because, I mean, this, you know, this looks like your pretty standard wingtip, but these are from Blake McKay. What's great about these, they're under $200. I think they're like $135, which is unbelievable, and they're the most comfortable wingtips I own. I could walk for hours in these things. I literally wore these to the horse races in San Diego and we were there for the full day and I literally couldn't stop talking about how comfortable my feet were because I was wearing these shoes. Um, super awesome. Like I said, kind of the most versatile shoe. You can wear these with denim, you can wear these with a suit, um, you can wear these to the office. You can pretty much wear them wherever. Probably not the beach, but anywhere else and you're good. So up next, let's go Allen Edmonds. So I got these Cornwallis from Allen Edmonds, nice blue leather, um, not quite a hole cut because of the, the broguing right here. So I guess this would be an Oxford, if you will. But once again, some nice broguing on the toe, a little broguing around the edges right here, which just makes it a beautiful shoe. Um, love these guys with suits. These are just, you know, they make a statement every time you wear them. Great quality shoe. If you guys know about Allen Edmonds, you know it's a quality shoe. If you don't, you should know about Allen Edmonds. So, needless to say, one of my favorite shoes. All right, second to last, if you guys follow me on Instagram, at Atlas and Mason, right here, follow me right now. Leave me a comment, say hi. Um, I wear these probably every six times I post a suited photo. These are from Gordon Rush. I've had these for like four years. They're still in pretty good shape. I have worn them as you can see they they you know you got to wear your shoes guys these have a nice light to dark patina um you know great leather made in italy great shoe super comfy and i get a ton of compliments on these shoes as well i mean i can't say enough about how much people comment and tell me they love my shoes when i wear these so that's probably another reason why they're my favorite because they do get complimented quite often and last but not least like I said, these shoes are not for every occasion and they are a little kind of outside the box of versatility. So these may not be your first six shoes, except for maybe the wingtips. And this one is definitely not your first dress shoe, but this um, velvet kind of paisley slipper from Magnani. Um, it's just, I wear these at New Year's, I wear these to weddings, I wear these for formal, formal events. And once again, I get a lot of compliments on these shoes. They're just a little bit different, a little out there. So you can't wear them that often because people, once they've seen them, they kind of have seen them. So, you know, it's not like 
a shoe that looks like every other shoe in your closet. This is a real, a real statement shoe, if I can get the detail on there. Let's see if we can show that. Yeah. So once again, you know, wear your shoes, guys. These are my six favorites. Um, I'll have links to at least the brands down below. I'm not sure if all these models are still available. Like I said, some of these are a couple years old because I've had them for a little bit. But these are my six favorite shoes at the moment. Hope this was helpful. If you want to see more videos about favorite things in my closet, like jackets, suits, whatever, let me know in the comments below and I'll get this series going. And um, yeah, thanks for watching guys. Be sure to subscribe at Jensange on Instagram. Subscribe to this channel right here, right now. Hit that bell, um, like this video. And that's about it guys. Thanks for watching. See you next time.